This beast of an animal is an extinct crocodilomorph called Dacosaurus. Like all marine reptiles, it was not a dinosaur. This prehistoric crocodile lived in the late Jurassic and early Cretaceous. This makes its exact years hard to place, but estimates go from anywhere between 130 to 150 million years ago. This immediately makes Dacosaurus unique as it lived across two major time periods. The majority of Dacosaurus fossils come from Europe, mainly the UK and Germany, however it has a decent fossil record coming from Argentina and Mexico. Around the mid to late 1800s when it was first discovered, Dacosaurus teeth were originally pinned as coming from an extinct theropod called Megalosaurus. The jaws and skull of Dacosaurus, combined with its serrated and compressed teeth, suggest a diet of larger marine reptiles as well as squid and fish. Modern crocodiles possess salt glands which help to excrete and extract excess sodium from the body when being exposed to seawater. While there is no direct evidence that Dacosaurus did have one, there is a cavity in the typical location of these glands, and it would also be extremely unusual if Dacosaurus did not possess one. This animal grew to be about 4-5 to five meters long and weighing anywhere between 200 and 275 kilos. Dacosaurus also had a tail fluke which would have helped to assist its propulsion in the water. Between living across major time periods and unusually dinosaur-like head, Dacosaurus was an incredibly unique and awesome marine reptile. There is plenty more to the discovery of Dacosaurus, and this was a very short summary, and I'd highly suggest reading more about it from the link in the pinned comment below.